Well, following that breast enlargement a few weeks ago, Martina is back with us to show us her new look. Well, she's uh, here now. It's lovely to, to see back. you in person. We've talked to you down the line before, so here you are in person. And uh, and the goal, as we've been saying um, throughout the, our promos this morning, and here you are now, is to have the biggest breasts in the world. Yeah. And so, how big are the biggest breasts in the world? The actual... The, the actual record holder is Maxi Mounts. She has 9,000 cc, 9 litre each side. But my implants are the biggest breast implants in the world. They are custom made and they rated each side for 20,000 cc, also 20 litres each side. So 20 litres each side. Now, obviously, you're not there yet no. um, mm -hmm. because uh, what have you got in there at the moment? Actual, we have 6,300 cc, also more than 6 litres, 6,300. So you've got 6, six litres in each. each. Yeah, 6,300. Right. Okay. Okay, okay. So, and, and the thing is, you can't just, even though inside the implant has the potential to go to 20 litres, this isn't something you can just do overnight because obviously containing that extra saline inside your breast, they need to stretch because the skin yeah. mm -hmm. isn't big enough to, to take that amount of, of liquid. Of, of course, they have, there's, breast tissue has to grow and to stretch and mm -hmm. also I have to train my muscles regularly. Mm -hmm. also in all day life, I have a special custom-made sports bra and I do sports every two days mm -hmm. to train all the muscles and we're going step by step. Also, actually it works very fast every two, every one week or every two week I'll, I'll fill up also, and pump up more saline. Put more in, yeah. So you go, yeah. to, you go to the doctor and they, they, put, the, they put the saline in. How, yeah. do, they, do you go under for that or is that something that they just do whilst you're awake? It's only um, the surgery was in May, end of May. Yeah. And this is only a fill up. It's here is a port under your on armpit. The, yeah, there is a valve. I can port. see that. I can see that. I don't know if you can see that. So, so that is so the, 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 there's really? access there where they can yeah, just under get the into skin. The... The, there's also a port. They, they, they connect a needle and then they pump um, saline. So you can see them grow. Yeah, they... I can feel them, and it's really interesting, and I like this. So. Um... Just as, a, as an illustration here as to what you want to achieve, those 20 litres per breast. Yeah. Um, the only thing we could find that we could pick up is actually, uh, I think it's 18.9 litres. Now, this is, here you go, here's a real water cooler moment. Uh, so when you walk past, if you're around a water cooler uh, this morning, um, then, uh, then these are 18.9. You want more than that. That's what you want to be carrying, that full weight step on by your step, chest. Step I have to train as well. Actual, it's really work, fine working up to 10, and but I step by step, I'm going to train this. Have what you sort of back one of muscles those? are you going to have? Have you have? tried to lift one of those? Because I, I, I tried to lift one earlier and I managed to do it. Well, don't but hurt... I mean, I, I did... one. Just... Don't hurt yourself. Try Just try, try one Please or both careful. or be really careful. Works. That's so, going to be on your chest. That's the reality. Yeah. How, well, how are you going to carry that? It's Training. Like a suitcase. Training. Training. OK, all right, pop those down. Just be really careful, please. I don't want you to hurt yourself. because It doesn't hurry. work for a long time, but in the future it will work for every day. But you do worry about... I mean, once you train, we all know that training is fine when you're training, and OK, you can train your muscles, but this is something that you're going to have... Uh, for life, I guess. I mean, yeah. you'll get to that point where, you know, throughout your age, your back hurts by the end of the day, I and mean, when we all feel it anyway, when we're not carrying around, don't they? a lot of people are having breast reduction surgery because of the impact it has on their back. Do, do you worry about that, the toll it's going to take on your spine? As we, you know, when I'm really, really old, I'm pretty sure I'm going a little bit down, maybe to this size, yeah. but as a well, I'm going to go bigger, bigger and bigger. And so that, so why? Why do you, why I do you I like want... big breasts. Also, I, when I got started, my dream goal was 2,000 cc. But when I reached 2,000 cc, I, oh, I like this results. I'm, I can handle more and I want more. Yeah. And I know my implants are really stretchy. They can handle also more. And in step by step, when I changed, I had 8,300 cc per side. And then with the new implants, we had to restart. By at, at the after surgery at 5,000 cc. Yeah. Now I have 6,300 cc and so climbing well, step by step. You you went to see a doctor, um, and yeah. not all doctors are prepared to do this. So the first doctor said, "Listen, I think you're, I think this is far enough now." I'm sorry, I went like that then. Mama, um, so... you have to say <laughs> this doctor was not pre um, not trained for big sizes. Yeah. He only was trained for 900 cc. But who's been trained for for that? I mean, the, the, so <laughs> if, it, if it hasn't been done before, if you'd have the biggest in the world, there is no training for that. You don't know the consequences. How are you going to sleep? 
act well, I'm sleeping on the back. And in the, when I'm going to the side, I need a pillow here and a pillow, two pillows here. On the belly, I have need two or three pillows here and two pillows here. So it's quite, I mean, it's, this is a lifestyle change. I mean, I know when you're pregnant and you lie on your back, the weight of the baby pushes down. Sometimes you can feel short of breath. That's a lot more weight than carrying a, a baby inside you. Yeah, yeah, I think so, yeah. So, so logistically, like Phil said, sleeping, I mean, bending down to put some shoes on, sitting it's down to looking. go to the loo. How, how you... It doesn't work in this direction, but it still works. But that's, as they, that's as they are now, not as they, not as they will be. I mean, if you tip, if you if tip, they're really on two li uh, twenty liters each side. Yeah, May Michael has to change my shoes. Yeah, maybe. Michael's on the other on the uh, other side of the studio somewhere. I don't think he always disappeared for the moment. <laughs> but um, but you uh, your husband is happy with this? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. We all do the surgeries as we the preparing together and the researching for the for the surgeons and yeah. also also he accompanied me while the surgery as he waited in my room and yeah. while the five hours really nervous like every husband. Yeah. But the complicated are not uh, not bigger than a small implant because when they are this in the surgery, they're small. They are, they're, there's no silent in scent. Yeah. They're, they're rolled like yeah. a like a stick. Yeah. And then fill it full of water. Yeah, it's only the, you can see the, the 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 cut is really small. Yeah. And they unfold it in the body. Yeah. But it's and still... they can fill them up. Oh, it's certainly and, very clever. And any surgery isn't without its risks. I wonder how he feels because, I mean, a lot of people and, and doctors will say that, you know, the risks of this, the saline leaking out into your body is dangerous. That can happen. Um, and the liquid, as a saline solution is, um, you get it in, in a lot of medicines. It is not dangerous. Mm -hmm. If the implants will break, it's going down and you go to the toilet. It's not dangerous. It's complicated when it breaks, but it's not dangerous. I don't know which dangerous. doctors explain that biology to you, but I don't think that that's going to happen. That if if your if your implant burst, it would be within it was in the skin. It's got no path to your bladder. I mean, it would. It, no, it, it, it goes. Also, when it breaks, yeah. it goes into the bo in the in the breast tissue. Yeah. And then the breast tissue collects this and bring it to the. Um, to here yeah. and then down to... But, I mean, that, if, if that's over a period of time, that's an enormous amount of salt. It's a saline solution, an enormous amount of salt in your body anyway. I mean, you know... You, you, we have you know, to say they don't will really explode. They will um, trip drop. Just, just burst it's, slowly. Yeah. Um, mm. the, uh, the, obviously, you are you're no stranger to controversy. Um, you've described yourself as, uh, as you know, a, a true African. A tr uh, so uh, you, you, you uh, become an African, you went over to, to Africa and, uh, and you had um, a ceremony over there. Um, and so you're quite used to people reacting in a negative way towards No, you. yesterday I had a really um, friendly one. At the airport, uh, there was an officer, security officer. She's my sister. You can, it's not a problem. Also, the, the, um, I was in the machine, mm -hmm. and the machine says, you have to control the back size. But they had to control the back size because I actually wearing two sport bras, and there are 11 hooks for the main bra, oh, and, set the and set three, the scanner off. three hacks. Three hooks for the second bra, so a lot of hooks in the back and the machine huh, I've never seen before, so the yeah. security had to check. But the um, guy, the black guy, said, she's, in, she's a friendly, don't worry. But did, did he know that in actual fact you were white? Yeah, he knows. And oh, then, they saw oh, you, you look like it's your it. sister. Um, and I know the next project for you, once the, the breasts are the size that you're happy with, is, is bum implants. You want to have the biggest bottom also? Yeah. In the world? Oh, no, I, I don't think so. No, only matching to my curves. Matching, only matching to the front? To... <laughs> That's a complicated part, because the butt implants are more complicated than the front. And so in, um, for the butt, you have to use um, the, the gummy bear, the um, silicone ones. And there you can go with big steps. Also here you can use a small implant mm -hmm. and pump it step yeah, by yeah. step. But for the back, it doesn't it work. Go in. It's the yeah. same. That's more complicated. Well, you must wow. come back and show us that yeah. uh, when uh, when it's done. Um, it's always uh, fascinating. An, an enormous amount of reaction online, as I'm, uh, I'm sure you're aware. We'll read some of those out uh, in a bit. But stay healthy. Yeah, stay well. Look after, look after yourself. yourself. Safety first. Yeah. Really extreme, but safety first. Okay. All right. All right. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank, Thank you. you.